Hi guys, welcome back to A Wizzy TV. It's your girl Lady Gorgeous, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I did my first set of XXL nails. And right now, the client has some very, very small fingers and small nail beds. As you can see, she bites her nails, but that's no issue. We're just going to go ahead and put the tips on and get straight to work. Make sure you go subscribe to my channel, go like, leave a thumbs up. And go turn on post notifications. Gang. So what I did here was I went and did the first hand first after I had filed and then I put the tips on so now I'm doing the opposite hand and the reason why I did this is because when you do that the nails more dry so right after you done filed it out you just apply the tips so it can be more dry meaning that it's going to stick better to the nail. So don't get mad at me, but on this next part, I thought I had recorded putting the tips on, and I guess I didn't. I don't know if it's lost footage or whatever, but just put the glue on the nails, then you put the other tip close to the edge of the other one, but not all the way at the edge, and it's that simple. Moving on to the next step. Just keep watching. Heading to the next step, now you're just filing down the extra tip that's hanging off the sides. If you want to drill, you can. I'm going to go ahead and take the easy route. Go ahead and drill that baby down, period. And yeah, keep tuning into the video. So pretty much I just drilled as much as I can to shape and we're going to give the pinky a pointed or stiletto shape, whatever you want to call it, whatever you prefer. And then we're going to give the other nose a little cute coffin shape. guys please be careful when you're filing you do not want that tip to fall off after all your hard work so i had an advantage because my tips were good they were pretty stable but just letting y'all know just to be careful
Today we're going to be using Dip Powder by Creations. And the glitter is from, I forgot the name. It's something that's like essential. But yeah. I dislike about the dip powder from creations is the fact that even if you put it on smooth it just ends up clumpy looking for some reason but the gel polish is what really saves it so don't worry about that but that's the only really thing that I dislike about it The glitter I got off of Amazon from the company Glam and Glitz.
after every acrylic full set that I do, I like to put clear gel polish. It gives it a nice, clean look. I believe it makes the nails look 10 times better. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you want to become a pretty savage, make sure you go like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for getting my channel to 400 subscribers. Now I'm on my way to 500. Woo woo. And I can't wait. So thank you guys for tuning in. See y'all in the next one.